so from village to dhaka college from dhaka college to north south university then what was the next step right next step the career career the career i started see with hsbc mm -hmm. uh, because i always thought the best how can i reach the best possible places available to me at my reach uh, so i started with hsbc and then that was 2001 september and i haven't completed my undergraduation yet mm -hmm. uh, so with hsbc i have started and i left hsbc uh, end of 2002 uh, 2003 and then I started at the time telecom was really, really very booming. Mm -hmm. You see telecom sector very flashy and uh, just started to grow in Bangladesh. So I went to work for telecom sector and I, I found uh, one of the Chinese company, the, one of the Chinese telecom vendor called JT Corporation. So I started with JT Corporation and then after JT I looked into the who is the best. I went to er Ericsson. Mm -hmm. It's a Swedish company, so it was another dream come true. So I found myself all of a sudden in a Swedish telecom giant in Ericsson. So I worked there and you see the telecom and then the Chinese again was taking over in the entire telecom sector. And who was then? The Huawei at the time. The Huawei was taking over across the world. So I went to Huawei. Uh, uh, when was that? Uh, uh, I worked for Huawei during 2010. 10. Hmm. I mean, 8 to 10, I mean, at that time. So, like JT, Ericsson, and then Huawei. Mm -hmm. uh, and then again, the telecom was going down. So, I thought to come out from this shit <laughs> again. <laughs> no, because uh, not that, to ruin your career. Yeah, like. not to ruin my And I was not really happy as well. Mm -hmm. because I kept on changing. I was not really uh, settling myself because I was not happy. I was not getting the things that I want to. You wanted more from I wanted life. more out of my life. I wanted to do more contribution. But job was very confined. You know, even though I was in a sales, marketing and business development, uh, always meeting the customers, always doing the bigger things in the front running, but I was not really happy. I was not really finding myself who I want to be. So I changed. I come. I then went to another American company called Dun and Bradstreet. It's a U.S.-based, uh, the best company of the. I mean, the credit rating company. You see, Standard and Poor. Mm -hmm. It was also coming from. It was one of the sister concern of H uh, of Dun and Bradstreet. Mm -hmm. So I worked for Dun and Bradstreet some time, uh, and then I positioned myself into the banking sector again. I, I mm -hmm. started with banking and then I came back again with the banking that, sector. Yeah. That was with Bragg Bank. So I worked for about five years in the Bragg Bank. From which year to which? Started with 2012, in July, and then uh, continued the next five years with the Bragg Bank. And probably, and not probably, it is the longest serving period of my life, mm -hmm. of my career. I had 16 you, you years. didn't work for this long in other companies? No, though. I did not. I was always restless. I was always... You know, what uh, more and what I is want the best? More. For, I know. was not satisfying, not, not satisfied myself, not my work even. Like in the work I was doing, I was okay, this is not the best. I could do probably best, more. So I kept on, kept on changing. I did not know the job is always like this, mm -hmm. probably. Mm -hmm. That was in my mind. I thought, okay, if I change, if I go to the better place, bigger place, maybe I can get more work. So, but I kept on changing. I kept on seeing the similar kind of confined area. The job has its own structure and it cannot go beyond than that. You have, you got to adhere some rules and regulations and you cannot do certain things that you want to, right? Mm -hmm. You have to have on your box, always, no matter what you do. Mm -hmm. So. Why 2012 to next five years I stayed because I got married, I got child, my first child, uh, my daughter came and then, you know, it has a diff another set of rules that really challenged me in a way that I had to, you know, because of the life. Lifestyle change. Lifestyle and so many changing. things you had to change um, because of the family matter and 